So guys, once again welcome back to Ahoy Navigos. We are continuing our trim types of problems. Today we are introducing a table to solve trim problems. So we have the table, overdraft, half draft. We will be having initial draft vertical right here. We will be having mean sinkage or ice age. That is W by TPC when the TPC is in centimeters. So the answer what we get for the mean sinkage or ice age is also in centimeters. And what thing you need to consider is this mean sinkage or ice age will be only happening only if you have a loading or discharging operation. In the case of shifting, there will be no weight discharged or loaded, so no change in displacement. So there is no mean sinkage or ice age. Also, you need to consider TA or TF. And if you add these three, you will be getting final drafts. That the sum of every three columns will give you final drafts, both cases. And we have in right side, you have all the equations of trim problems. Graph correction, we already discussed F by LBP into trim. And the trimming cost, trimming moment divided by MCTC in centimeters. And the trimming aft is equal to AF by LBP into TC. And your trimming forward is equal to trim change, total trim change minus trim aft. So we will be using this table to solve all our problems. So let's see how we prob solve our problems. So first question, we have type A problems, we'll be discussing. First question is type 1, shift of weight already on board. So the question is, a ship 100 meter long draws 4 meter forward and 5.2 meter aft. HF is 2 meter abaft midships, MCT is equal to 160 ton meter, TPC is equal to 15. 100 tons of cargo was shifted from number 3 low hold to number 1 lower hold through a horizontal distance of 32 meters, we need to find the new drafts fore and aft. So let's see how we solve these types of problem using our table. First thing what we need to do is, question is given HF, we need to find the position of our center of flotation. It is given HF is 2 meter abaft midship. We know the length of the ship, that is 100 divided by 2, you will get the midship, that's 50 meter, and it's a 2 meter abaft midship, so that's 50 minus 2, 48 meters. Next thing what we need to do is, we need to do, put our forward and initial forward and aft draft in our table. So let's put our initial forward and aft draft in table. It's 4 and 5.2. In the question, it's given 4 meter forward and 5.2 meter aft. We put that value in our tables, 4 and 5.2. Next thing. Next thing is, we need to find mean sinkage or rise age. In the problem, as we said, there is no loading or discharging, it's only shifting. So there is no mean sinkage or rise age, it's dash dash, nothing. Next thing what we need to find is TA or TA. For finding TA, we know, we need to know TC. We know AF, we know LBP. We need to find TC. To find TC, we need to know trimming moment. MCTC we have in our question, and the answer is always in centimeters. If you write this way, you will never forget or have confusion in converting into centimeters on meters. So always write this in centimeters in meters in your question so that you will be safe in every side. So we need to find first our trimming moment. Trimming moment is W into D. You know the weight is 100 ton and the distance D is equal distance shifted. That is 32 meters. So that will be 3200 tons meter. And the ship, it is said. The weight is shifted from number 3 lower hold to number 1 lower hold. So we can say this is a forward shift. So that's by head. So is in centimeters we can say. Equation trimming moment divided by MCTC. Trimming moment is 3200 divided by 160. That's 20 centimeters. Similarly TA we can say AF by LBP into TC. That's equal to 48 divided by 100. 48 we already calculated AF divided by LBP is equal to 100 meters in question into TC is 20 centimeters. So you will get the answer 9.6 centimeters. When we convert it into meters, 0 0.096 meters. Similarly, we can calculate TF, that's TC minus TA, 20 minus 9.6, that's 10.4 centimeters, that's 0 0.104 meters. So we know the value of TA and TF, and the important thing is sign of TA and TF. This is always a confusion. 
So the sign of T and TF is as per trimming moment. If the ship is trimmed by head, that means your TF is added to your draft. And if trimming moment is by stern, your TA is added to your whichever side the moment is, that side you will add and the other side you will subtract. So in this case, we got the value of T and TF value is plus 0 0.104 because it's trimmed by head. So plus to TF and minus to TA. And your final drafts will be 4.104 and 5.504. So that's your answer for the question. So final drafts will be 4.104 and 5.104 meters. So next, next thing what we're learning is type 2 problems. Those are the discharging a weight. Last week it was shifting a weight. In this case it's discharging weight. So the present draft of a ship is 140 meter long at 8.1 forward and 9.9 .9 meter aft. TPC is 30, MCTC is 250 ton meters, HF is 3 meter forward, 300 ton ballast was pumped out. And number 5 dB, COG is 50 meter above touch. Find the new, new drafts forward and aft. So, first thing as we do, HF is equal to 3 meter forward. Now, the length of the ship, we need to find AF, that's 140 divided by 2 will give you a midship, that's 70. And it said HF is 3 meter forward. So, midship is 70 plus 3, that's 73 meters. Next thing, Mean sinkage or rise age. We will go to a table and put the values initial drafts 8.1, 9.9. Next thing, mean sinkage. And mean sinkage is equal to W by TPC in centimeters. That's yes. weight is 300 divided by 30. That gives you 10 centimeters. That's 0.1 meters. Since this is discharge, it is a rise age. So this value is minus. So we put the values as minus 0.1, both forward and aft. Next thing what we need to find is T or TF, for that we need to find TC. TC is equal to trimming moment divided by MCTC. So let, let's get into it. What's trimming moment? W into D. One thing what you need to notice in this case is W is equal to 300 and D. Value of D is always, as we said in our type A problems, value is always from your center of flotation. In the question it's given 5 dBT COG 50 meter back of H. That means the distance was given with respect to H. But what we need, suppose this is the COG of weight and midship was here and the distance was given as 50 meters. But we need COG of weight with respect to COF. So as in the question COF is 3 meter forward of H, that means it is here, somewhat here. So it's the value of F, that's 3 meter. So we can say the total distance of COG from F will be 50 plus 3. That's 53. That's what I written here. 50 plus 3. That's 300 into 50 plus 3 is 5900. And the trimming, since we are pumping out from the stern or half, we will be having a moment by head. So, D is always from COF to COG of weight. That's what the important thing. Next thing, TC in centimeters equal to trimming moment divided by MCTC. Moment we know 5900 divided by MCTC in question 250. With the value of 63.6 centimeters. And TA we know AF by LBP into TC. And AF is 73 divided by 140 into 63.6. We get the value is 33.2 centimeters. So you know the value of TA now 0 0.332 meters. In, and TF is TZ minus TA. 63.6 minus 33.2. That's 30.4. So we know the value of TA and TF now. So let's put it in our table. Value of TA since it's trimmed by head, we have already said add to plus to forward draft and minus to your half draft plus 0 0.304 and minus 0 0.332. The final draft is 8.304 and 9.468. So you got the answers of our question. Final draft is 8.304 and 9.468. I hope you guys understood. We'll be coming with more types of trim problems in future videos. Stay tuned to how Navigos. Thank you.